Dog the Bounty Hunter reveals crucial clues in Brian Laundrie's search from surveillance at Walmart to poop at campsite. Dog, who joined the search for slain hiker Gabby Petito's fugitive fiancé last month, shared his most enticing revelations with The Sun on Friday. In the two weeks since he officially announced his independent search effort, Dog said he's gained invaluable information that he believes will lead to Laundrie's capture. Is he still alive? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's alive, dog, real name Dwayne Chapman, told the son. Do they wish we thought he was dead? Oh, yeah. Do they wish that we thought that his body was being eaten by alligators? Oh, yeah. He said he's also grown even more confident that Laundry is responsible for Gabby's death the longer he remains on the run. In the beginning, I thought, Gabby's death, was not intentional, second-degree involuntary, manslaughter, he said. Now, the way he's running, I think it's more than that. Laundry had been weeks into a cross-country trip with his fiancée and he returned home to his parents' house without her on September 1st. Gabby's parents reported her missing on September 11th and her remains were found a week later in a Wyoming national park, by which time Laundry had been reported missing by his parents. Walmart surveillance. Dog said he spent a substantial amount of time collecting surveillance video evidence that could help locate laundry. On Friday, he visited a Walmart where the manager granted him access to a 24-hour surveillance camera, he said. He did not specify if anything significant was found on that footage, but described a trash can located under the camera as a criminal smorgasbord. Fecal find. Late last week, Dog announced that he discovered a campsite potentially linked to laundry at the Fort de Soto campground. The site offered an important clue, poop. Dog said he was disappointed to learn that DNA could not be recovered from human feces. However, he said there were hopes that toilet paper used in the act would have DNA on it.